Brigham Young is rallying. So let's go back. Jim Nance, how the Cougars doing right now? Well, Brett, New Mexico had a short punt, so BYU came right back firing. Lindsley to Richard Zayas, a backup receiver. Zayas picks up 47 yards, set up a one-yard dive for a touchdown by Lakehe Muli. BYU takes the lead. New Mexico has missed an extra point. There's less than three minutes to go in that one. Let's go back to Brenton Era. You call that one, Brent. Run of eight yards. Now for an update, let's go back to our New York studios, and here's Jim Nance. All right, Vern, an impressive run by Kenny Flowers of Clemson. Here he takes the handoff, breaks off a one tackle, then runs untouched into the end zone the rest of the way. Clemson now in front of Maryland, third quarter. Back to Vernon Tech. All right, Clemson leading that one, Jim. We've got a tie game with 145 to go third period and a second down and two for in the third quarter. Adams going left. Knocked out of bounds. Now let's go to Jim Nance in our New York studios for this update. All right, Vern. Pat, imagine if you could have thrown the long ball like this. Jimmy Harbaugh, the senior for Michigan, 42 yards to John Polisar. Look at the grab. Touchdown in this 20-3 Michigan third quarter. Let's go back to Vernon Pat. Okay, your turn. All right, Jimmy Nance. No fair picking on me. So I couldn't throw the long ball, but I sure handed off well, didn't I? <laughs> A lot of horses behind me. at halftime we told everyone that Columbia is in the unusual position of leading a football game here Dan Bowditch breaks away for the Lions and goes in for the score and Columbia could be breaking their 30 game winless streak let's go back to Brenton era it is a first and 10 the ball is at the 42 yard line 